Here's the scoop. We're bringing Resident Evil 4 to Quest 2 later this year. My colleagues at Oculus Studios are working closely with Armature and Capcom to rework the entire game for VR. Only on Quest 2 will you be able to play RE4 from Leon's first-person perspective. Stay tuned for more Resident Evil 4 updates in the lead-up to its launch on Quest 2 later this year. Hi, I'm Mike Morishita, executive producer at Facebook. Resident Evil, the franchise that changed the way we think about video games, is still going strong after 25 years. Congratulations, Capcom, on this incredible milestone. Now let's rewind for a moment. I remember when Resident Evil 4 launched in 2005. It was amazing, brilliant. Nobody had ever seen a game like it before. And it remains at the pinnacle of the survival horror genre. In the 16 years since the launch of Resident Evil 4, the gaming industry has evolved and new ways to play have entered the market. And we've been eager to explore how Resident Evil 4 could be enhanced for a modern audience. I'm Mike Verdue, VP of Content at Facebook Reality Labs. I'm excited to announce that Capcom, Oculus Studios, and Armature Studio are partnering to bring Resident Evil 4 to Quest 2. We're thrilled about this game. We can't wait for you to experience the world of Resident Evil in a new medium. It's immersive, comes with a first-person perspective, and will bring new richness and depth to the Resident Evil 4 experience you know and love. You'll be able to step inside the game for the first time. Tune in to the Oculus Gaming Showcase next week, April 21st, for more details on Resident Evil 4 VR. How we brought this title to this new medium and you can check out some additional gameplay footage as well. You can tune in on the Oculus Facebook page or on Twitch. My father? I still awake.